This day in history of the Walt Disney World Resort for November 19th and 20th. November 19th, 1971. Walt Disney World's Fort Wilderness Resort and Campground opens, inviting adventurous guests to stroll meandering pathways, take beautiful horseback rides down nature trails, and explore hundreds of acres of natural beauty, and they haven't even hit the parks yet. Resort guests can make all their dreams come true when they sleep under the stars in over 700 acres of cypress and pine woods at Wilderness Campground. There are over 780 campsites for the brave outdoor type guests and around 400 wilderness cabins featuring full kitchens, daily housekeeping service and an outside deck with a grill. November 20th, 1989. The Minnie Mouse $10 bill is released on this day and joins Mickey on the one and Goofy on the $5 bill. As the Disney Dollars Collection continues to grow as the official currency at the Walt Disney World Resort and Disney properties around the world. November 19th, 1990. Walt Disney World's Beach Club Resort opens. This deluxe resort shares the spotlight with its older sister, Disney's Yacht Club. The pale blue and pink buildings, decorative cut shingles, French doors, and seashell motifs are just like the popular architectural style for New England seaside wooden cottages in the late 1800s. The resort features Stormalong Bay, a three-acre water recreation area featuring a sandy bottom pool with bubbling fountains, whirlpools, and a shipwrecked water slide all along the shores of Disney's Crescent Lake. And that's this day in history of the Walt Disney World Resort for November 19th and 20th. Be sure to catch the next show. It includes the debut of the Timekeeper over at Disney's Magic Kingdom. We'll see you then.